Hey there, gang, and welcome to the locker room. Coach Geeks here, and today's message, extreme ownership. As you probably know, if you follow this locker room every day, I'm reading a book called Extreme Ownership, and it's written by a Navy SEAL, and it was given to me by Greg Soto. Thank you so much for this book, Greg. I'm getting a whole lot out of it. And I wanted to just take a moment and share with you something from this book that has really inspired me, and I hope it inspires you. One of the chapters in there talks about principle, and this principle that he talks about is taking ownership of the results in your life, good and bad. It's so easy for us to take ownership when things go good and feel like it's nobody's, you know, that I did it, I made it happen. You know, you know the guy in the end zone, he gets down on his knee, he looks up to heaven, he thanks God. Well, I wonder if he thanks God when things don't go well. Because we have to own everything from our successes to our failures and know that in our failures are the biggest blessings because that's where you're going to learn. That's where you're going to grow. And so extreme ownership, if you get this book, is going to prep you for taking ownership of every result in your life. Most importantly, the failures, the mistakes, instead of blaming somebody, instead of blaming the situation, the company, your manager, stop that. That is totally taking power away from you. You want to have all the power you possibly can. And the only way is through extreme ownership. Own the results in your life. If you don't like where you're at right now, you can change that by changing your thoughts and your actions. You know this. You should know this if this is your 100th, 200th video that you've watched or have read anything. You know, I I, I was very uh, excited the other day when I was visiting with my partners and David because what we talked about and we continue to talk about is that All of us knows exactly what to do. Most of you out there, you know what to do. You know how important it is to set goals and write them down. So we don't suffer in our lives from what we don't know. We suffer from what we do know and don't do. So when are you going to take ownership of your problems, your mistakes, your failures, your setbacks? And on that day and every day going forward, if you do that, then you're going to climb a lot higher in life and you're going to be the one that people go to. However, you're going to say to them, I don't have all the answers because the more I know, the more I realize how little I know. It's an ongoing process forever and ever and ever. And so that's my message today, gang. Take extreme ownership of every result in your life. Do something about it. Make an improvement. And guess what you'll have? Best life ever right afterwards. Thanks for joining me in today's Locker Room, gang. And we'll see you in tomorrow's broadcast. Bye-bye.